What is going on? What do you want from me? Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. So today we are back on Yellow SMP, and um, we are on episode 6, and we can't die anymore, and I'm so scared that I don't know what to do. But um, I logged on earlier. You know, I just came in my house, and then I see this. Like, what the frick is this? And, you know, this honestly... Ugh, look at the door open. This looks like a witch ritual. And it looks like someone is trying to frame me because I'm the witch of the server. And at first, I thought it was Rachie who was trying to frame me. You know, put it in a bunch of people's houses, and they'll be like, Oh, look, it looks like a witch ritual. K must have done it, but no, no, it was Cole. Cole did this, and we're gonna get her back. She decides to start a prank war, and we're gonna continue it, and it's gonna be unexpected. No one will see it coming. Now, because I just want to take it chill this episode, because I'm really scared to go out, um, we're gonna make a little home for our fox hound babies. Because they deserve a better home than this. And I have a lot of work to do with my area. Like, so much terraforming. Oh, my sword is pretty strong, I would say. Hopefully, I can survive everything. But, let's go ahead and scout out an area for our foxhounds. I was kind of thinking like what if I just kind of like leave this mountain here and we create like a little cave back here for them. I think that would be kind of nice. We have to make them feel like they're at home so I want to use some netherrack and possibly nether brick. And I don't think I have that much netherrack meaning uh we might have to go to the nether again. I remember while I was doing this I was making fire protection last time. Let's see. Okay yeah. It's pretty simple. Um, let's go ahead and finish our fire protection. Okay, so I got a uh, pro no fire protection. Oh, yeah. So I got fire protection eight on all my armor right here. I should probably just switch this out because that keeps confusing me. What the heck happened to like my pickaxe, my axe? Did I like use it all up already? Well, I guess let's go ahead and make a new one. All right, I say let's go ahead and carve out this area a little bit more. Excavator makes things so much easier. Oh, ooh, okay, we have a problem. So this hill leads over here, which is where I was going to flatten. And this is a tiny problem now. So we have to reevaluate where we want to put our foxes. I can always just like make a tiny hill right over here and put them inside. Or I could put them in this hill. Because I don't think I'm going to take down this hill. Yeah, I think this hill might be fine. I completely forgot about my mother wyvern. It's been a while. Um, it looks like I don't have a saddle on me. So let's go ahead and grab a saddle. Wait, did I put a saddle on her already? <gasps> Wait, why is it so low health? Ooh, we need a heal. What would you feed to like a wyvern to heal it? Okay, I have made three splash potions of healing to heal my wyvern. Hopefully that works. Okay, I don't understand why it's low health. And it's not even full grown yet. Here, let's bring her over here. Maybe she like suffocated in the wall as she was growing or something. I don't know, but you stay safe. Oh my goodness. She's so big. They grow up so fast. <laughs> okay, back to this. Yes, we can have it like slowly going down-ish. Um, and because we want them to feel at home, we're gonna put like little splotches of netherrack over here. Then we can also add like some of the nether brick. I don't want to make them feel like I uh, took them away from their home, which I kind of did, but that's not the point. Ooh, yes, I like the look of this. Maybe we should have like some areas go down a bit. Now this is probably like dangerous towards me, but not towards them. So we're going to add some 
fire in here for them. Keep them nice and warm. Make them feel even more at home. And now that I think about it, they need lava to feel at home. The nether has so much lava. So, let's go ahead, head down to the mine, and grab some buckets of lava. Okay, I got like five buckets of lava and i'm thinking maybe we could do like a lava fall you know let's see if this will work yeah i like that and we could add like a couple around here oh you know even if i walked into that fire i don't think it would hurt me that much because i have like fire protection eight in here Ooh, we need to add some glowstone for light yes yes i am very much liking the look of this hmm what should i do the walls because i don't want to do nether brick as well okay so i'm looking at like nether stuff and these like other nether bricks we could do like chiseled nether bricks Ooh, this one looks a fury nether brick that looks nice but that would require us going into the nether and i'm not sure if i'm up for that let's go ahead and look at the chiseled nether bricks before we make any uh big decisions to go back to the nether again <gasps> lively netherrack that looks kind of cool we'll just have like a mixture of nether brick chiseled nether brick this one looks cool and let's choose maybe some lava bricks let's try some of that should add those like near the bottom or we could just have pillars of these ones Ooh, maybe maybe hold on let's see is this regular nether brick yes no add splotches of that i like this lively nether brick but it just doesn't work well with oh with um this thing so let's go ahead and chill this into something else like maybe this one you can see a slight difference and i think it's fine i don't know how i feel about this lava brick maybe this could be at the entrance so maybe something like right here okay okay um i can see something with this <gasps> i oh no i just got rid of my lava uh, uh okay this is how it came out so far um i'd say it's looking very nether like i just need to add some gates here and i think there are nether brick fence gates oh hello manticore oh my god that reminds me Can you give me an egg and be my manti version 2 no okay oh well i think i have another uh egg in the chest down there so we're gonna go hatch that after because we need manti back um, let's go ahead and bring our foxy babies over here. Sit up. Why- why are you not sitting up? What is going on? What do you want from me? You want some coal? You have to sit it up with coal? Interesting. Alright guys, come on. Come on. We're going into your forever home. Guys? Oh, there you are. Everyone? In here. Come on. Yay! sit right here you can sit over here and you can sit right there and we are missing one hello what you doing oh are you by a torch no you're not <gasps> they're so cute and you can sit right here sit down <gasps> yes okay let's go make those fence gates Okay, so it turns out I can't make um, regular nether brick. I, I think I have to find them, but <gasps> Wait, I didn't have to go to the nether for fury nether bricks. Oh, well, well this lively one Looks very lively to make a fence gate out of. Let's go ahead and do that <gasps> I just remembered I could have put the wyvern and the hot spring water to heal it. Man, am I being dumb this episode? Oh my god, you freaking scared me. <gasps> my dogs all just teleported right here. I think that is looking real nice. Let's go ahead and make a sign so everyone knows it's the fox baby place. All right, and we have the fox. We have the foxhound cave where I hold my little fox babies. Oh, don't dare attack me. All right, now I just want you guys to just like spread out a little more, you know. Come here. Come back here. Wait, did I sit? Wait, that time is sat up. What the 
what the heck? I'm like so confused with these guys. So now that our foxhound all have a home, let's go ahead and see if the wyverns are grown up yet. No, still? How long do you need to grow? Or, oh wait, maybe it was grown all along. It's just hitbox is so far. <gasps> Look at us go. Can I put a like um armor? Hopefully I can. Let's try this. Stay there. We will be right back. Yes, I have the best diamond armor. <gasps> Look at it. Looking real gladdery. Gla gladiatory. Now I just, you know, have to like keep my pinky off shift. So I don't... Now, because Cole pranked us, let's go check out her area. Let's take our newly born wyvern and we're gonna go scout out the area you know see what kind of ideas we have oh my gosh look how fast this is so much faster than my i mean my manticore like sorry manticore i love you but this wyvern is everything sleep cole lives right over here so let's go ahead and see what kind of prank we can do the area here's a house and this right here is her farm and here is her waystone which uh, apparently i didn't click so there we go it's so hard to get onto this wyvern nothing really pops up in my mind right now so if you guys have any prank suggestions let me know down in the comments below and i will keep on thinking okay now that we're back home we have some manti and i think I have an egg. Yes, I have an egg right here. And we are actually let's hatch let's hatch it inside. This one is gonna be called Manti 2.0. <gasps> Manti 2.0. <gasps> Manti! I've missed you so much. Okay, don't get stay on the floor. Don't talk back at me. And we also have the dark manticore and fire manticore. So let's go ahead and hatch them too. Oh, hello, wyvern. Stick in your... Oh, oh, let's name this one Midnight. I can't remember if I named uh, Mada one and the other in season one Midnight, but oh well. And last but not least, we have the fire manticore. And I think I named my last one Fury. So for this one, I might name, hmm, let's name it, let's name it Blazy, like that. <gasps> yes, you guys can wander around, hang out, just don't walk out the door and die, okay? And don't grow up to suffocate in a wall. Now, the only manticore we're actually missing is the, um, the ice one, what was it? The snow manticore. That is something I've been wanting to get, and... I couldn't. Guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode here. We will venture out to find um, the snow manticore whenever I feel brave enough to leave my territory. But yeah, if you guys like this video, be sure to give it a like. Subscribe if you want to see more of my content. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!